Good morning, guys. It's very cloudy and we're expecting thunderstorms today. And so, but that's okay, you know. At least the temperatures are finally in a more comfortable zone, so I don't have to worry about freezing anymore when it's storming out. Anyway, an update on that little fledgling that I done a video on yesterday. The little fellow has been with its mother this morning. It keeps flying back onto the porch. And mommy is feeding its seed, but it's also learning to eat for itself. So the mother is training its little one to become independent. I have seen it on the porch twice today. So the little one is doing great. I didn't have to worry about a fledgling trying to live on my patio until it could get away. So, but it's fun to watch. The little fella's getting fat. <laughs> anyway, I want to welcome my new subscribers. Thank you so much for being here. I greatly appreciate it. Thank you so much. We'll get down to business here in just a minute. Once again, I've done great on OMAD. Now, uh, on the first of every month, our church has an eat in the in the uh, dining area instead of just going straight to the sanctuary. And last night was no exception. Now, before uh, it was just pizza night, and you know, no problem. Last night was fried chicken, mashed potatoes and gravy dinner rolls and like wow it tested my strength for sure and um, I passed <laughs> hubby came with his plate with a nice juicy breast and <laughs> the dinner roll and the mashed potatoes and the gravy and I looked at it for a little bit looked at him and then I started talking to the woman beside me to distract myself because it the good thing is I really didn't smell the chicken if I had smelled it that probably would have been my undoing but I really didn't smell it which might have been the Holy Spirit doing that for me because other than that just looking at it was delicious but I wasn't smelling it so that's good and no my sinuses wasn't stopped up or anything I just I wasn't smelling the chicken you know uh, usually when there's fried chicken it's a very strong aroma but I wasn't smelling it so yay <laughs> and it helped a lot me talking to the woman that was beside me who happened to have not ate herself which made it even easier so I passed I stuck with just the OMAD yesterday I didn't give in and ate and my body was hungry but I said, no, you're not giving in. And so I was hoping to have lost another pound in many ounces. I was really hoping to be 179 today. Uh, I weighed myself last night and the weight looked awesome. Looked great. 
And so, you know, I was thinking, all right, 179, 179. And I rang myself this morning and it was 181.0. <laughs> Two pounds away. <laughs> um, but, you know, that's okay. It's okay. Uh, it is another two ounces lost. And like I said, I did manage to pass last night, despite with all that goodness there, I, I passed it. So, and I feel great this morning. I feel great this morning. I'm not hungry. So it's awesome. It's awesome. I did it. I did it. I'm a conqueror. I'm a conqueror. God's word says that I am more than a conqueror through Christ Jesus who strengthens me. And I can do all things through Christ Jesus. So, yes, through the strength of God, I can do this. I'm good. So, seeing that I was 181.0 this morning, it's going to be awesome to see how much I weigh tomorrow. Because I guarantee you, I'm going to do it again today. You know, I got thinking yesterday, even though the body is somewhat aggravating when it starts telling you that it's hungry, I really, I, I can appreciate the hunger. I can appreciate it because that means that my body is having to break down the fat and stuff for energy. So, embrace the hunger that hits me in the evening instead of giving in to it. You know, just embrace that hunger because my body is having to utilize what's available instead of me fueling it myself. So, yeah, um... I'm going to start embracing the hunger instead of instead of agonizing over it. I'm going to start embracing it. I mean, it's not like I'm not fueling my body. It's not like I'm, I'm starving it or anything, because I'm not. And so when it does start to complain about being hungry, I'm just I'm going to embrace that and force it to utilize more of the energy storage that it had put away for hard times and enjoy the benefits from it. So anyway, you'll be seeing me tomorrow with another journey vlog. I love every one of you guys. Have a great day.